doctor in evil? Soon to be a doctor. So mind as well. To me, you're a doctor already. But soon to be. Sir, I was the one that broke the news. But I'm also the one that, you know, that gives you your very first interview, you know, as the new superintendent. Sir, a lot of people are watching us in Yonkers. A lot of people with kids in the, in the school system. What do you have to tell them? Uh, well, first, I'm going to say you know, I'm grateful to the Board of Trustees, the Mayor, uh, for this opportunity. I'm looking forward to learning more about Yonkers. Obviously, there's only so much you can learn from websites and news articles, but I'm looking to uh, make myself visible, visit schools, meet with various uh, stakeholder groups as I look to learn. I, I won't be here till May, but I'm excited to be here. I'm looking forward to continue to build on the excellence in many of our schools. Uh, the work that is uh, that our students are already currently achieving. You know, we have one of the best graduation rates in the state of New York. For uh, we have the best in terms of the Big Five, and uh, looking to build on that, and looking to continue to grow opportunities, and you know, build pathways for our kids to continue to be successful. Now, sir, charter schools. I asked you that question before, but this is more like a one-on-one. -on -one. How is your view? I know that in your district you have about 20 charter schools in your district. In Yonkers, we have one. Well, how is your view expanding? How you perceive to be your projection? Yeah, so I, I don't have anything against charter schools. I think they serve a purpose. They, you know, their initial intent was to be hubs of innovation that the rest of the public school system could learn from. Uh, you know, I come in from the capital region of New York, where there are a lot more charter schools in the Albany. In Schenectady, we only have currently one. Um, and what I would say is, you know, I'm the superintendent for the city of, you know, will soon be the superintendent for the city of Yonkers, and I'll serve those kids and those families um, and make sure that, you know, there isn't a reason for them to choose anything else but their current public school system here in Yonkers. Uh, that doesn't mean that uh, there's anything against them by making that choice. Um, but what I would say is, you know, our goal is to make sure that the public school system is the best option for them. And my goal will be to continue to build that, that excellence and to make sure that our families stay with us. Now, sir, that is a concern for many, many parents in Yonkers. I don't know how you handle that situation in your school district, but tell us, how we, what is your view on that? Bullying inside the schools. Yeah, I think bullying is always a, a situation that every school community deals with. Uh, I think what we can do is proactively educate kids, you know, on differences, on making sure that we focus on things on inclusion, making sure we recognize cultural, religious differences, uh, and make sure we give kids space for them to circle up with their colleagues, with their friends, or with uh, even staff to have safe spaces to have conversations. A lot of times, bullying is a result of not knowing, not knowing the other person's background, not knowing the other person's story, or, you know, falling in line with, you know, sometimes national stories, national medias. Uh, you know, the, the focus on polarizing topics, um, that if you sit down and get people together, you usually find more commonality than you do find differences. Uh, but bullying will exist and we will need to continue to be proactive. And when it does come, we will make sure we you know, follow our code of conduct and make sure that if there are consequences that need to be given, that those are given. And then when there's opportunities to restore relationships, that we do that as well. Well, sir, thank you very much. Welcome to my beautiful city, because this city is mine too. It's yours, all right. Well, definitely is. And I wish you the best of luck. Pleasure and uh, hopefully we will talk again soon. Yeah, congratulations on breaking the, the news story. Hey, that's what I do. Thank you, sir. Sorry, take care.